They're back. They're back at it again. Digi Home Strikes Back. This infamous game. Rebranded as Road Rage. Yes, Digital Homicide, the two man development studio that has since lost their fr frivolous case against Jim Sterling, is back at, at it again using a new account called Lutoot Games to upload this notorious classic to Steam. Road Rage, which is just an unauthorized rebranding of Big Rigs Over the Road Racing. They think they're so clever that they can get away with uploading someone else's game under a different name using a fake account. Even with Steam's new Direct program that replaces Greenlight is not enough to stop it. And look! They didn't even bother to modify the main menu screen with the new title! Okay, you've probably heard of this one. Big Rigs Over the Road Racing is one of the worst video games of all time. And it is unique in its own right because it is it is widely compared to many of those Steam Early Access games that you find that are pre-alpha at best and barely work. But this was released back in 2003, right before Steam was even introduced. However, this is actually a racing game made by... Whoa, there's actually... This was actually produced by Game Mill, a now defunct company, because... No surprise, look at this game. Why would they even continue to produce games after shipping this turret out to the bargain bin in Walmart? Now we actually have Sergi T-Dog. That, that name sounds familiar. Yes, Sergi T-Dog, the, the main director for Big Rigs, was also responsible for from another substandard game litter onto Steam called The War Z. You know, that MMO shoot -em shoot zombie shooter that scammed a lot of gamers into hundreds or even thousands of dollars just to, just to play a campaign or replace a character that, 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 that was just killed off in a game that barely even functions. And now you've destroy destroyed all your credibility in the video game industry. There is no future for you, buddy. And your primary cars are basically... Just generic trucks like, um, Thunder, Megon, Thunderbolt, and Sunrise West W12. I'm gonna pick with Megon. Weird name, Megon. And we have, of course, five different stages to sit, technically choose from. Devil's Passage, Devil's Passage 2, Forgotten Road 1, Night Ride, and Small Town Road. And if you pick Night Ride, This is awesome! <laughs> Look! I'm driving through the mountains here. We Look! This big rig, this truck, can actually climb over the steepest mountains! Nothing is slowing it down! Look! See, look at this vertical bounce! Watch what happens! You climb, you crawl upward! In fact, climbing up... Uh, climbing up 90 degree slopes actually makes you go faster! And you clip through everything! And not even buildings! Look, I clip right through buildings! <laughs> Grabbing! I be coming! This truck be coming round the mountains! Here it comes! Honk, honk. I be climbing down passages! Here I come! I'm driving through bridges! Grabbing through pipes! <laughs> I'm not even trying to win a race here! I'm just trying to find as many mountains to climb and as many buildings to drive through. And no, there's no, there's actually no uh, mini-map to tell you where you are or how close the race is. And as you can see, the numbers are actually going outside the box. Find my way back. Where did I go? Whoa! What the hell? <laughs> I'm out of control! Yes, sir. 
I see this is a finished product, yes! You... And now the truck has left the game. Okay, I think I made my way back. And by the way, this is the only sound you hear. And I lost. Okay, here we go again. Let's try the other trucks. And of course, Small Town Road, depending on which version you have, the, um, Night Ride will actually crash the game. So in the version I got, it actually loaded me to this level, but it was nothing like the screenshot in the on the on the select menu. Yeah, I was right. It was actually, um, why am I starting at the finish line? Did they even test this? Depending on which version you have, your opponent will actually move very slowly or not move at all. Whoa, what the? I, I, my truck just disappeared? Actually, it goes under the bridge. Why go under the bridge? Why go on the bridge where you can go under, through the bridge? And the bugs don't even fare much better or worse. It's just the same super power control and reverse mechanisms. And wh the tail- why are the tail lights painted on the trailer? Look at how tall this mountain is. Look! Woo! See, look, it can climb over just as many mountains as Megon can. Look, I'm scaling the mountain. <laughs> Let's reverse. Let's open the gates of time. <laughs> Thanks for watching, I really hope you liked this video. If you want to check out more from Mario Nama, please hit the subscribe button below, or go to my website at www.mariomedia.com. And if you really like the content, be sure to support me on Patreon, and as always, sign on.